I'm Howard Hale with the Horseman's Corner, bringing you useful information from people involved with the world of horses. I'll be back with today's guest right after this. If you have a horse to sell or if you're looking for a horse, go to horsemanscorner.com. If you want to list one for only 10 bucks a head, you can list your horse with pictures and video on a website that's promoted on 22 great radio stations from Portela's, New Mexico to Great Falls, Montana. It's easy to list your horse, so go to horsemanscorner.com. Horsemanscorner.com and either list your horse or if you're looking to buy, go to horsemanscorner.com. Dr. Steve Peters is with us. He's a neuroscientist, worked a lot with humans and the functioning of their brain, but really interested in horses, so turned his direction that way, tied up with Martin Black with a book called Evidence-Based Horsemanship. How did that come about? What I decided to do, I only had seven horses at the time, and in science, to say anything, you need a large group. So I had to find somebody who had lots of observations of horses and had lots of horses. I hooked up with Martin Black. And Martin Black's a fifth-generation cowboy, pretty well-known. He had colt-starting businesses where he'd start 500 colts in a year. So he grew up around horses, observations of racehorses, mustangs, million-dollar horses. You name it, he's, he's seen it and worked with those horses. So we just started to compare notes. And I, was, I started to dissect out horse brains and look at what all the connections were and how they worked. Martin would say something like, a lot of people think this. And I said, but Martin, that can't really happen because the horse doesn't have that part of its brain to be able to do that. Dr. Steve Peters, we'll hear more from him on the next Horseman's Corner. Thanks for joining us. May God bless you. Join us again, won't you? I'm Howard Hayes.